Next, I want to introduce you to creating a presentation. To create a presentation, you'll click on New and you'll click Google Slides. Google Slides is very similar to Microsoft PowerPoint. And you'll see it comes up with an untitled presentation. And it's only got one slide in the presentation to start with. First of all, we could give it a theme if we want to. So I'll just go down and look at some of the themes that are here. And it, themes are things like background colors, text colors, and so forth. So we can, we can change this later if we want to. So I'll just click on um, this one called Material. And it's showing me that I can click to add a title here. So depending on what I want to make my presentation over, I might be, for example, discussing how to sell a car. And I can add a subtitle down here. And I could say, hints from a pro. Okay, and that's my first slide in my slideshow. I can then add another slide if I want to. There's a plus symbol here. I can click on the plus symbol and would add a slide with the same layout that I just had. But I can click the down arrow, I'm sorry, yeah, the down arrow here, and I can find different formats for the slides that I want to create. So maybe I just want to have a blank slide. I can click blank. And now I've got a blank slide, but I can't put any text directly in here. I can't type anything. I've got to add uh, items. I can add things like images and shapes, or I could just add a text box. I'll click on text box, and I can create a box where I can type in text. And I can continue with my slideshow. I can say the items I'd like to discuss today are um, where do I figure the value of my car and of course I can highlight this and I can uh, apply text formatting to this make it bigger if I want to similar to the word processor and I'll change this to find the value of my car and then I can press enter and I can continue with my slideshow. I can delete slides by clicking on the slide and then um, choosing to press the delete key and it goes away. So that's how I would create a slideshow. I can undo that. Undo is my very favorite thing to do. I'll undo that delete. But you click on the slide that you want and you choose delete. If you want to move a slide up or down in the presentation, you can just drag the slide over here in the thumbnail view to where you want it to go. In this case, there's only two slides, but as I add more slides, they will appear here. Now, how do I save this? Again, there is no file save, but you can just give it a name. You don't even have to give it a name. It's actually being saved right now. If you click back over here to My Drive, you'll see that there's an untitled presentation. But we do want to give it a name, so I'll call it How to Sell a Car. And if I click off of this, you can see back over here in my drive, I'll now have a document called How to Sell a Car. And it's a slideshow that I can use to present um, to a class or to a group, something like that. So that's how I would initially create a, a, a slideshow similar to a PowerPoint presentation.